welcome to Malloween, Janine. I love it. Malloween and Janine. And I Debbie, know. The queen. Not tonight, though. No, I'm not the queen. I am actually, guess who, who am I? You're Elsa, of course. Yeah, everybody's been coming up to me. I had a couple little Olafs come and run into me as I came through the door. And uh, I decided to be a superhero. I am Supergirl. Not Wonder Woman, Supergirl, there's a difference. Last year we did the fairies and that was a big hit here at the Laurel Mall. I was and the fairy godmother. I think we did good this year because we did a split screen of you and Elsa and me and Supergirl and we nailed it. This is our second year here at the Laurel Mall. Yes. And there are, I don't know how many kids. A hundred million thousand that, kids here. Yeah, it's like crawling with kids and adults and everybody's dressed up, everybody's excited. All the merchants are giving out candy and the mall is at full capacity. So could you imagine the stash of candy? I just like it here because usually for Halloween, you know, the kids have their costumes on outside and their jackets are over them. So you can't even see what, or understand what they are. You can't really hear them and everyone's freezing. So in here at least, you know, they can walk around in an environment that's comfortable. Well, tonight, we're going to interview all these kids. We're getting already applause Wowie. by the audience here. We're going to see all these kids. We're going to have some fun. We get to be something that we're normally not. We get superpowers, and you get to put people on ice. I get to freeze your freeze. There you go. Janine's froze, and I finally get Let a chance to stop. Oh, Let no. it go. Freeze, freeze. All right, so as I was saying, we're going to go around and talk to some of the kids, so stay with us. As I always say, call your friends, get everybody to watch, watch on your app, download the SSP TV app, and we'll be right back. Should I unfreeze her? All right, unfreeze. Let it go, let it go. dressed as tonight? A witch. Oh, and I know you're a beautiful witch. Does the witch have a special name? What's your name? My name is Sally Cruz. Oh, that's a beautiful name. What is your name, honey? Jessica. Jessica. And what are you dressed as? A vampire. A vampire. Hey, you know, I'm looking for the most unique costumes, and I think the popcorn's got it in the bag. Get it in the bag? What's your name? Melina. How did you pick your costume? In school. In school? What do you mean in school? From one of my teacher's bulletin boards. Oh, okay. And is mom getting some credit? Because I, I like to credit moms. I'm Supergirl. I'm all about the women tonight. Yeah. So where's mama? Right. Here's mom. Tell me how you made the costume. Um, I just 
found a box. My sister actually had it. Um, I got some red satin from Walmart, white duct tape. I found the popcorn template online. I painted it and I made these out of great foam, the insulation spray and just put it all together. You know, costumes are so expensive when you go out and you can't spend less than $40 on a costume. So was, was this something inexpensive and, it, and it's so yes. unique? Um, I would say it probably cost me maybe about $15. And guess what? You can either sell it or you can have a smaller sibling exactly. use it next year. Right, exactly. Very good. Well, high five mom. Thanks. Very good. Are you buttered popcorn? Are you flavored popcorn? Come on, tell me something. Buttery popcorn. Buttery yeah. Popcorn. And she lights up too. Oh, let me see it light up. Now, mom, look at mom. Sh look at this. Very nice. Well, high five. Pop those kernels and I'll let you move along and get your candy. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. How do you walk in something like this? I always pick for me, it's like the costume that's the most comfortable. So, can I, how did you pick your costume? Uh, my mom got it. Your mom got it? I don't even know if I can hear you right now. Your mom got it. Can you breathe in these? Yeah. Yes, yes. Is there oxygen flowing through there? Yeah. Okay, so your mom got your costume? Yep. Go ahead, I'll, t I'll let you talk through the zipper. How about that? All right, perfect. So, how are you breathing in that? Uh, there's this thing that keeps like the oxygen coming and keeps it blowing up. All right, there's like a fan in there? Keep you blown, and then how are you guys walking? I mean, it's I mean it's not that hard. Like, like the, it's like so like there's just these little things right here, but like it's it's kind of hard, but like you have to walk like like kind of okay. like you kind of have to waddle, and we're gonna show you. I know we're holding up the line, but if you see their feet are stuck on the bottom there. Very cool, very cool. I'll let you guys move along. Okay, well I found best friends forever here, and this is what's your name? Gianna Martinez. And what is your name? Jada. Jada Sala. Yeah, we were chatting a little bit earlier, so tell me something that best friends do. Well, best friends do nice and kind stuff to each other, and they show love to each other, just like their family members and stuff like that. And she's my favorite best friend ever, and she will always be, no matter what. Well, we got some superheroes here. We got Batgirl, we got Supergirl, we got Batman, and we got Wonder Woman, right? Are we having fun? Let's say candy. Let me hear you. Say candy. Candy. All right. What's your favorite candy? Chocolate. All right. What's your favorite candy? Uh, All of the above? Everything? Chocolate too. All right. Everyone likes chocolate. And we're here at the mall. Hi. Are you having a good time? Yeah. What's your name? I said Batman. Oh, your name's Bat. Good job. Your name is Batman tonight. Did you get a lot of candy here at the mall? Yeah. All right. And how did you guys pick your costumes? Who wants to talk? How did you pick out what you were going to be this year? Go ahead. Because we are at the store and, and then we found this costume and, and it was nice so I picked this one. Very good. You tried it on? Was it the first one you tried on? I didn't try it on. You were just like, that's it. It's coming home with me. It's pink. I just got it. All right. She just got it. End of story. Very good. High five. Fly away with our cape. I'll see you later. as you know from being on the show before we're going to ask the question I don't know if you counted how many yet but how many kids do you think are here tonight we surpassed last year compared to last year I'm going to estimate about 750 because it started at play zone and wrapped around the whole mall right out the front main yeah. what do you think brought them up to the mall besides you besides me <laughs> that was a good one uh, I think all our advertising that we do of course SSP TV 
and you know between SSPTV, the standard speaker, and on our digital board. So it really does work. And you know the people know that the Laurel Mall does this every year, so we get the word out through your station. Well, this is a lot of fun for the kids. But how many merchants are here now that are participating? We have 68 merchants and about 60 of them participate. And this is something that's been tradition here at the Laurel Mall for a while. Yeah, it's been going on, I believe, since the 80s. So, and it grows and grows and grows every year. And I and I got to say, this is nice because it's indoors. As a parent, it's in a safe environment. Uh, you know the candy that they're getting is safe, so it's it's a really great event. No, you're right, Janine, and that's the one thing a lot of parents, you know, they'll say it's it's a safe haven for the kids, and that's why the Laura Mall and, and the tenants like to do it for them. Well, I have two requests for next year. I'm going to say it on the show. One is that we have contests for scariest, most unique costume, and the second is that you have to dress up. I, okay, I'll tell you what. You got it for next Girl year. Girl said so. Super oh. girl. Maybe I'll go as Superman. There you go. I have superpowers, so what I say goes tonight only. That's what I was told from uh, the uh, the rest of the crew of SSP TV. You have superpowers. Well, just as long as you don't ask her to sing, if that's going to be one of her requests, because every single show she wants to sing. You want to sing? She makes well, if you want to sing, I take it away. Me. If you want to sing, come and join the MPB choir. There you go. I'll be there on Sunday. The mass will be empty. <laughs> That's for sure. Okay. Well, Rocco, go get Lisa because we know who the real brains of the operation is here. But thanks for well, doing thank this again. Well, thank you. I'll go find uh, Lisa. She She's is. the mad oh, hatter. Here fact, she is. She's the mad hatter. Here she is now. There yeah, she is. Right right here. Come on, mad hatter. Mad hatter. Come here a minute. Come here, mad hatter. Love it. All right. Go All right. Center stage. <laughs> Let's talk about your costume. I just put it together last minute. I love it. It's like hodgepodge, right? Yeah, I'm supposed to be the Mad Hatter, but I made these spider lollipops, so I figure I'm going to put them on me before I give them to the grandchildren. I love it. Multitask. Well, you got a great turnout tonight. It's a great event to have all these kids come here in a safe environment. We were talking to Rocco about yes, that. Yes, they love it. They love it. We're doing it a little slow so that we don't we don't have gaps in the line. We don't want anybody to get lost and miss out on any candy. So everybody's having a great time. Very good. Well, happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. Happy Malloween. I love it. <laughs> John the Pumpkin Man Shigo, and everyone knows him from Claire's and McAdoo here from the Strand, providing the entertainment for the evening. We are having a great time here, <laughs> Malloween 2017. There's like so many people here. It's like amazing. The costumes are awesome. We're just having like such a blast out here tonight. You're used to being around kids. I mean, you can't get away from them. Oh, absolutely. God, I was talking to you before, and you're handing out some kind of coupons for over at the Strand, but you were giving out lollipops earlier. You ran out. I was helping give out lollipops for Rocco. We got coupons for our Halloween dance and costume party and for skating, and just everyone's having a blast. All right, well, we're going to have some fun here with the kids. Thanks for taking time. He's the John O'Lantern tonight. John O'Lantern. Oh, John O'Lantern. John O'Lantern, yes. Bad joke. All right, we're in the, the middle of the mad chaos. This is where it all takes place. All of this candy is being handed out. There's like one million kids here, and I'm with Anthony. And you have the task of passing out this candy. How's it been? Oh, it's been great, I guess. I mean... Kind of an easy job. I mean, what kid doesn't like candy? Exactly, yeah. It's just... If it makes them happy, then we'll give them candy. Very good. All right, how much candy do you think you'll give out tonight? I don't know, but we only have about 750 pieces. So and it just depends on the number of kids that there is. All right, girls. Girls, so how much candy, what's the rule here of thumb on how much candy you pass out at a time? Like, one, is it like one, one piece a person? One, one little piece like this? Yeah. All right, well, this is mine. I'm going to 
going to take this piece <laughs> and I'm going to run with it. I'm looking for anybody here who can tell me a Halloween joke. Someone who has Halloween joke. You have a Halloween joke? Am I going to be able to hear you? Go ahead. What's your Halloween joke? What did the spooky candle say to the other spooky candle? What did the spooky candle say to the other spooky candle? What? Let's go out tonight. Let's go out tonight. But um, bump Very good. Thank you so much. Oh, this is a family affair, right? Where's mom? All right. All right. All right, original costumes, original costumes I'm looking for and I love it. Mom, you did a good job. So talk about your costumes and did you make well, them? No, we bought them. Okay. Um, I figured because they're all things to me because they're all my babies. <laughs> so you know, mommy of all things. And I have, I'm pregnant with three girls. I have my two girls and my one in my belly and then my son. So they're both cat in the hat. Okay, so you have four children. Yes. And one on the way. Yes. Okay, so it's like when you're counting, if they're all here, it's like one, two, three, you might as well just trust them up. <laughs> right. Very good. Adorable. Enjoy. Happy Halloween. Happy Halloween. What did the ghost say at the bar? What did the ghost say at the bar? I'm just here for the booze. I'm here for the booze. Very good. Okay, well it's been two hours of fun, 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 and more fun, Janine. We had tricksters and jokesters and singers and all kinds of kids doing all kinds of acts to get candy. We got to work on our jokes. We had a couple kids giving jokes and a lot of unique costumes here tonight. So it's always fun here to just interact with the kids. And uh, there were a lot of kids here and most of them are all taller than me. Yeah, I well, mean, plus. Well, they're so. growing them big now these days, Janine. I guess when uh, you were born, it was down in just our little shrimp bill. Shrimp bill. Yeah. Next year maybe we'll dress up in a uh, shrimp. I'll shrimp. be shrimp and lobster. Shrimps? Is that even a word? Shrimp. Yeah, shrimp. Oh, okay. Yeah, jumbo shrimp. There you the go. Oxymoron. All right, so how many kids did you count? I would say there's over a thousand kids here. Yeah, well, I got the official count from the mall official. Okay. They were counting, and there's like 1,256 kids. Not 100, 1,250. Not 1,260, there's 1,256. I want to know who counted all these children. Well, they forgot to count you, so that'd be 1,257, 7, 58, 59, and dad. Yeah. Six. He's going around eating all the candy, I'm sure. Well, I'm sure he is, because he loves. Did you ever try and get a Snicker bar from your father? You oh, know, we mentioned God. at the beginning of the show what we craved when we were pregnant. When I was pregnant with my daughter, it was Snicker bars. And it wasn't, you know, I couldn't just have the little size the little snack size it was like the super size monster one and it would just you know sit right on my stomach yeah well that's one thing that we have in common if i crave potato chips i don't have one potato chip it's like the them. commercial it's like whatever size bag i buy yeah that's my bag so i have to buy a small bag otherwise it's the whole big bag very good yeah, well so. thanks for joining us here at Halloween. the show is going to air for an entire week and then if you missed it you can check it out on the app which is good because i know mom's will like to see their kiddos in costume. 
Yeah, I had more fun than the kids, I think, did. I enjoy getting dressed up. I enjoy having you join us. I hope if you weren't able to get out and see the kids, you could take part next year. And as always, we'll see you next time on the girls. Happy Halloween!